Hi children, how are you all? I hope all are fine. My name is Sirisha. I'm English teacher. Today we are going to teach Abel for the cat. This is the first term, first lesson. This written by an Isra Faber. There are many stories in which animals talk like human beings. Such stories are called fable. Yusuf was a famous storyteller. He lived about 2,600 years ago in Greece. He wrote many stories in which animals talk. These stories are known as Yusuf fables. Today we are going to learn one of the Yusuf fables story. That is the A Bell for the Cat. Here you will read another of Yusuf fables. It is a, about a cat. This cat was giving the mice a big problem. It was catching and eating many of the mice daily. Mice daily very sadly at the poor mice would say, what can we do? What can we do? They were all very sad and unhappy. One day, one of the old mice called a meeting. He said, we must find some way to solve our problem. How can we keep that hungry cat from catching any more of us? Each one of in the meeting talked and talked and talked. No one could think of any good way to solve the problem. At last, a little mouse stood up. I know what to do, he said. Tell us quick, tell us quick, shout all the others. Then, Stop shouting and listen, said the little mouse. The cat, the cat makes no noise when it comes. It is so quiet. It comes quietly and catches one of us. We can't hear any sound of its paws. I think we should put a bell around the cat's neck. Thus, we can hear when it comes, we can the easily run for the Cover. How wise, how wise, shouted one. Yeah, we are saved, we are saved, shouted another. We will put a bell on the cat, shouted all the others. All the mice began to shout with joy. Yes, we are saved, we are saved. So, among them, there was a quite old mice. He stood up and looked at the little mouse. That is a good idea, very good. That is a good idea. Bell for the cat, that is a good idea. We are saved. Yes, uh, um, he, he was very wise. Yeah, yeah, very good, very good. But a bell for the cat, yes, yeah, a bell on the cat. But just tell me who will bell the cat? I'm asked, who will bell the cat? Yes, bell the cat is the right answer. Yeah, we are saved. We have solved the problem. That is very good. But who will build the cat? At once, the room become all quiet. Yes, tell us who will build the cat. Yes, everyone would ask her. Yeah, you will build the cat. Who will build the cat? Yes, we are saved. My God, please, please, who will build the cat? Is asked. Everyone look at at the little mouse. Little mouse was shocked. Me. Me? Me bell for the cat? Not I, said the little mouse and ran out of the room. And another one we are looking. And me? Not I, said another and ran out of the room. Another one we are looking, another one. Me? Not I, said the thought and ran out of the room. One by one, all the mice ran out of the room. No one was ready to the bell the cat. Who will build the cat? Nobody will build the cat because we are giving two ideas but not implement. So one of the person implement the ideas, we are all of us saved but become as anybody is not ready to build for the cat. It's given to ideas is more than one but who will build the cat? It's nobody will build the cat. Anybody is our save, our life uh, only, my life is save. I am only save, I am only save. But one, one, my says, will for the cat, that we are saved, all of us. But uh, anybody is not ready to will for the cat. 
this is the a bell for the cat what is the moral in this story it is as a said than dog okay my dear children this is the story of bell for the cat thank you and this is these are hard words in this lesson first one is is up we are first one letter is a but we not uh, so in at all in the s up is up e a e s o p is up and then catching c a t c h i n g catching and third one is unhappy u n h a p p y unhappy s h o u t i n g shouting and everyone e v e r y o n e everyone hungry h u n g r y hungry and easily e a s i l y easily quietly q u i e t l y quietly and another a n o t h e r another moral m o r a t l okay my dear children read well learn well once again read in this lesson yourself and uh, stay home study well 